Hello and welcome. Let's go over how to get the information you need and submit a request for service using the new and improved PGC 311 app. There are three ways to access PGC 311 services. Through the PGC 311 app, which is available for download from the Apple App Store and the Android Play Store on your mobile device. Through the web portal. Or just dial 311. We're going to focus on the mobile app, since it's the most convenient option. The web portal is set up the same way as the mobile app, so these instructions will also be helpful if you access PGC 311 online. First things first, go to the Apple App Store or the Google Play Store to download and install the app. Feel free to pause the video while you download and register your account. Now let's get into it. This is what the app icon looks like. Clicking on it will take you to this home screen, which includes an easy to use service list. The service list has four tiles. First up is request. This is where you can submit service requests. Next is recent. This is a list of the most recent requests for service submitted throughout the county. My request is where registered users can see a history of their service requests. The knowledge tile is where you'll learn about what to expect and how to have a successful service experience. The knowledge tile is the best place to start because it tells you everything you need to know to make a specific service request. This is the knowledge tile main screen. Click on trending articles to find frequently searched topics. Use the magnifying glass icon to quickly find what you're looking for. The blue FAQ box is where you can find answers to frequently asked questions. This section summarizes information into easy to read chunks. Here you can also find links and numbers to get more information or get your request for service completed. The blue information box is where you can find supplemental information about services and other topics. The knowledge section is always evolving thanks to your customer feedback. So please let us know what else we should add. Let's click back to the main home screen and click the request tile so we can submit a request for service. The easiest way to start a request for service is to use the search feature. You can type in keywords here and it will populate the screen with options for you to choose from. The keywords you use do not have to be the exact same of the service. The app will pull up all related services to your keywords. You can also click other to get a full list. At the bottom of this page is a tracker that follows the five steps to submit a service request and tells you where you are in the process. You can see that right now, we're on the first step. Once you've selected a service, you'll see a brief description that will help you make sure that you've selected the correct service. You'll also see the agency responsible for delivering the service you selected. The estimated time of completion is displayed here. Now let's say you read all this info and realize this is not the service you wanted. Just click the arrow at the top of the screen to go back. But we do not need to go back since this is the exact service we wanted. Once your desired service is selected, you'll be asked to provide the location where the service will be performed. If there's no specific address, no problem. Just drop a pin on a map. Now just confirm that this is the location you want. Now we need to give PGC 311 all the information we can. Photos are preferred because they can help the county determine the scope location, and any potential issues before sending someone out. On-screen questions will guide you through key information. As you enter information, alerts will pop up about the service you're requesting. Be sure to read them. For example, if the county doesn't provide the requested service, you'll see an alert letting you know and information about how you can get your request fulfilled. Another example would be if the app thought another service would better fit your request. If this happens, just click the pop-up and you'll automatically be redirected to the correct service. You may also get pop-ups with additional resources like helpful links and phone numbers and updated estimated completion timelines based on the information you provide. For all requests, it's very helpful to provide your contact information. We respect your privacy so any information you provide is never shared with outside entities. If contact information is provided, you'll receive follow-up emails with status updates for your request. 
You can also track this through the app under My Request. Contact information is optional for most requests, but some service requests require contact information to be able to follow up with you. After all questions have been answered, you'll see a screen where you can review your information for accuracy before submitting. Be sure to correct any errors. Once you've submitted your request, a thank you note will appear confirming that your request has been submitted, along with the service request number for your reference. This screen will give you a completion date and a live link to view the status of your request. Now that you have a request in the system, what happens next? You can check on the status of your request in the My Request tile. So let's go back to the main screen and click on My Request. Registering for an account on PGC311 allows you to receive real-time updates and communication regarding your service request. With registration, you can also easily review the history of all your service requests. It will also sync with the web portal since they share the same data. Any information shared with PGC311 will remain private and secure. We never share or sell your information to anyone. Now you know how to explore the new PGC311 app, submit a request for service, check the status of your request, and use the knowledge tile to get all the information you need. The app has many other helpful features for Prince George's County residents, so feel free to explore it and let us know what you think. We value and encourage all feedback and suggestions. With your feedback, PGC311 will keep getting better and better.